in video description I have provided the link to download free practice model please subscribe to this channel hey friends in this video we are going to see the design guidelines for the boss and the gussets so boss is the feature which is used to attach the plastic part with the mating part by using the fasteners so boss can be used to impart strength or as an attachment of a and a locating feature so boss is act as a attachment feature and also locating feature if you have the pin or mating part you have the boss then it will act as a locating feature it is recommended to add gusset plates to bosses used to an attachment feature so gussets is nothing but the side support which is given to the screw boss so that the strength of the boss will be good independently gussets can also be used as a flow inherence and as a strength feature so gussets the purpose of gusset is to have the strength and so if you are adding to the boss then your boss will get more strength so here we have the design guidelines for the creating the boss so this d capital d is according to your fastener so size 2d is nothing but 2 into dimension of your fastener for example if you are taking 20 mm fastener then your outer dia should be 2 into 20 40 then this width this should be 0.6 of the nominal thickness nominal thickness is nothing but the part thickness and then we need to provide 0.5 draft on the edges minimum then moving on to next one styling features can be applied to hide sink marks caused by the rib bar process so while adding the bars because of more material it will have the sink issue so to avoiding that in style itself we can have the feature like this on the boss area reduced boss section with strengthening assets and incorporating radius so here we have the E is the gusset height. So gusset height should not equal to or less than 4 into T nominal thickness radius 0.25 into nominal thickness. So height of the screw bar should be 2 to 4 times of the nominal thickness. So the same here they have highlighted. Inside diameter of a hollow bar should be two or three times the nominal thickness so inside <coughs> inside the hollow it should be two or three so here we need to avoid the designs like this so thin and then sharp edges on the boss area should also well. and then the thick of the material should be avoided and then two tall bosses should be avoided if you are having the screw mounting on this area you need to have the profile to hold the screw head so that your feature will have more strength and as well as it will sit properly then we need to have the cassettes this is the preferred design boss height should be 22 sorry 2 to 3 times of the outer diameter so outer diameter if you are taking 20 then you will length of the hollow channel should be sum of the screw length plus 0.5 so if you are having the screw of 10 mm your dimension from this head to this one should be 10.5 to accommodate the chip if you are using the self 
self tapping screws then the chip removing on the process will uh, accommodate the if you are not providing the 0.5 mm clearance then the chip will be accommodated on the screw head screw area itself so it will create some stress on this one it will lead to break on your part radius here junction should be radius at the junction should be 25 percentage of nominal thickness so here uh, 25 percentage of your nominal thickness radius should be added so in this one they are talking about the failures of the screw bosses so high loop stress caused because of too much interference of the internal diameter with the insert so this area the internal diameter <coughs> is created by the help of insert if your insert is more then length is more then it will cause the damage to the pause length line is nothing but your uh, material flowing and the joining area so if the net line is coming on the gusset then it will create the defect on this area so it will create easily it will split on this area so whenever you are creating the bus while doing the mold for analysis according to that you need to keep your boss also the line, line should be relocated away from the boss if possible if not if not possible then you need to have the gussets so here we need to have the minimum of 0.6 t near the hollow on this one so net line strengthening techniques so here it is showing as a poor if you are adding fillet on this area then you will have the better boss strength and then we need to have the gusset like this instead of keeping the corners so the material will get cooled easily and the strength of the should be more so small t more thickness around a boss so these are the some CAD model so this is wrong with without having any supports so this perpendicular our horizontal support is good for this boss and then we can have the cassettes like this all thickness of the boss no more than 60 percentage of the wall thickness create the boss so if it is having like this this is incorrect we need to have the boss like this in the corner area boss at corner sinks on outer surface so it will have the sink in video description i have provided the link to download free practice model please subscribe to this channel